Over the last couple of weeks, I've been attempting to catch as many fish species as I can, but all through the ice. Last video, we caught four of the 22 species on my list. This weekend, I'm headed to a cabin with my buddy Brett. Weather forecast was calling for calm days, but temperatures are expected to dip below negative 20. Our goal is to find some trout. The lakes we're wanting to explore have the potential for brook trout, lakers, splake, and rainbow trout. We have a bunch of different lakes on our list, but first we have to shovel out the cabin and get the fire going. I left that shovel out there because I knew if someone came, yeah. it would be like, perfect. <laughs> Gotta get back to the cabin here. Brett's gonna go start the fire. You only move forward. Here we go. After unpacking and prepping the cabin for our stay, we hit the road to start our adventure. All right, after a lot of exploring, going down some, uh, some sketchy roads, I think we found an access point here. It looks like it's public. I'm gonna go confirm uh, some of these. I think we're good. All it says is do not block the road. All right, we're gonna grab the spud bar, check the ice. It looks really slushy on top where there's been a snowmobile before, but uh, yeah, it's looking really promising. Ice. All right, I'm gonna set a jump jack over here. The ice is pretty crap. Lots of water on top, lots of snow, and not as much ice as we'd hoped for, especially on January 20th. Okay, so we got this pile of wood right here. Going right off the end. Not yet. All right guys, I'm out here with my buddy Brett. We've been searching for trout all afternoon and we've had zero luck, but check out how beautiful this lake is. We've had the whole lake to ourselves all day. It's 
absolutely beautiful. And uh, I'm really happy that we're out here. Although we're not catching them. They're supposed to be spike on this lake. Uh, we've tried all over the place, but have had no luck. We haven't even had a mark yet. So we're gonna regroup for tomorrow and uh, hopefully we can catch a couple trout species. We're hoping to maybe go after a lake trout and then hopefully catch our splake tomorrow. We still have a couple more minutes here of daylight. Hopefully we can get one before we head out. But if not, we'll see you in the morning. All right, guys, this is our second day up in the Huntsville area. We're searching for trout. Yesterday, we got absolutely skunked. We didn't even mark a fish yesterday, guys. We went to a couple different lakes, try to check them out. Uh, the access is pretty tough at this time of year with all the snow. And since we're going by foot, it's really tough trudging through this foot and a half of snow, even though it's pretty light. Hopefully we get into the lakes we want to go to today and hopefully we can get on some fish. So stay tuned. <laughs> we got to a little crossroads in the road here. The plow kind of stopped right here. And it's just snow and go tracks going down. We have about 750 uh, meters to the lake. So going down should be no problem going downhill, but coming back up will be fun. But hopefully it's worth it for some small lake brook trout. Give her. Look how far he's going. <laughs> Woo. You going for it again? You could probably sit in it like this, man. Oh man, I, was, I felt good, man. Yeah, you think you could do it again? Hell yeah. Here, dude, if you try following me, I'll, I'll try filming you unless you wanna. Okay, I'll come right behind you. Unreal. Damn, we covered a lot of ground there. We did. And we got a we got a sled on the way back, so it's not gonna be as bad. That was sick. This is too cool not to video. No? You don't hear Just trekked up this hill all the way back, kilometer from the lake we're at. Caught zero fish, had zero bites, marked three fish. It was uh, pretty cold. <laughs> and uh, now it's time to go back and get some food and have a couple more beers. 
Hopefully we can get some fish tonight. Burbit. <laughs> yeah, burbit tonight. Woo. Still a beautiful day. So we're going back on the lake. This time we're not going after trout. We're going after some nighttime burbies. this yet. Where those other buckets came from. Hit a rock. After a full day of fishing, we still had no fish to show for it. Although we were still enjoying ourselves, spending majority of the day outside despite the cold temperatures. Uncle Ben's bag cell and venison sausage from the Crabels. One more stop for perch. We had one more most exciting to small perch break ever. On our way home, we decided to fish an old reliable spot that we knew we'd be able to catch a few. Oh yeah, you're fucking marking it. Although we didn't catch those trout we were looking for. We still had an amazing weekend, exploring new lakes and catching up with a good buddy. It was an amazing time in the lake, enjoying the beautiful scenery and good company, which is really what this channel is all about.